Good morning traders, Tamar here, FX Globe Ambassador. With your morning bell for Wednesday, the 16th of November 2022. And we've got a jam packed economic calendar for today. And we're going to start with UK CPI. And analysts expect a reading of 10.7%. So, still in a double digit. Last month, we had a reading of 10.1%. So, we can see there's still high expectation of an increase in inflation in the UK and the market that I'll be watching quite closely is for potential short opportunities will be the pound versus the Swiss very nice downtrend there on all higher time frame and for potential long opportunities I'll be keeping an eye on the pound versus the yen mind you the pound versus the US looks very nice but we reacting to a very strong level of 1.2 so I'd like to see a deeper pullback in and around the 1.17 before looking for higher time frame trading opportunities to the long side however if we start to see the bulls coming back into the pound versus the US then I'd like to take a potential opportunity on a much lower time frame and be out before that very strong 1.2 level next on the card is Canadian CPI and analysts expect a reading of 0.8 percent so we've seen some weakening of the Canadian dollar in the last couple of weeks if we we'll see some strength coming back into the Canadian dollar I'll be looking at Aussie CAD and Kiwi CAD because the recent uh, uptrend or uh, increase in the Aussie and the Kiwi against the Canadian could look at simple pullback in the context of the higher time frame so the weekly and the monthly so I'll be looking for a resumption of this higher time frame short trend or sell trend the other one is dollar versus the Canadian so if we'll see a weakening Canadian then I'll be looking at a potential reaction to that 1.32 area and a continuation of the higher time frame uptrend Next on the card, we've got the US consumer uh, or retail sales. So that's a, a strong indication also of economic activities or consumer spending as well to see retail sales. So I'll be looking at US dollar crosses and of course the index market. And for the night owls, we also have Aussie uh, economics news coming out. So we're going to see unemployment numbers and unemployment rate and the ASX 200 is one of my favorite index at the moment for long opportunities because we have broke a significant swing lower high on the weekly and the monthly chart so I'll be looking for potential pullbacks into the level of in and around 7000 and I'll be looking for a resumption of this uptrend happy trading everyone and I'll speak to you soon Bye for now.